Jesus, my hair looks really gross. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And it's lightning. I'm outside against a brick wall at nighttime, and it's lightning now. I completely lied yesterday, and I'm sorry. I don't have a topic today. Not at all. Today, actually, I had sort of like a chronic anxiety attack all day. And, like, it would get better sometimes, and it would get like way, 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 way worse. I'm sitting like this now. So I don't really know what's up with that. I just hate the lack of not knowing what to do about it either. Like there's nothing, there's nothing I can do to sort of make it go away or get better. I don't want to just be popping a Xanax every time I feel a little bit uneasy about a situation. And that just sucks a lot. Like I want to be normal. I feel like my anxiety takes a toll on everyone else around me and I hate that I am I'm letting it be that and I'm letting it control me to that point where it's blocking people. I try to deal with my anxiety as much as I can like by myself and I want to like overcome it and I do that as much as I can like to the highest extent that I can't, I can't do any more than I'm doing. And that's not like a way of me saying like, oh, I'm helpless. Like, I'm trying so fucking hard. And it just really sucks sometimes because I don't know what else to do. I feel like I've tried literally everything there is and there's nothing I can do about it. I really like to psychoanalyze other people and sort of like dig out and get what they're thinking, but I can't psychoanalyze myself. I drafted an email to my professor about why I've been on my phone for the last three days in class and not just like a little bit on my phone. Like I have, <laughs> I've been doing little else than taking notes um, off his PowerPoint and being on my phone when I wasn't looking up the slide to take notes because I get so anxious in that class. I have to keep myself distracted or I'll pass out. I just, I feel now I need to apologize to my professor who has no policy on phones in class. We're allowed to be on our phones as much or as little as we want to and he's not going to say anything unless we come to him and be like, I'm really dissatisfied with my grade. And he'll be like, well, he's stopping on your phone all the damn time and we'll see what happens. Even knowing that he's permitting us to be on our phones, I still feel uncomfortable and like he's judging me and thinking that I'm a subpar student because I'm on my phone. despite my grade in that class and that just really sucks and I can't control that thought I can't make it go away I try so fucking hard all the fucking time and nothing works and I hate it honestly my biggest fear right now is that I'm gonna go home and it's gonna be exactly like this for the rest of my life I don't know how to fix that and it's really scary to me I guess I lied again. That was, there was a theme. It's pretty structured around that. That was a really cheerful video. I feel like shit. I'm gonna go edit this and watch the Fosters and go to sleep. There's a storm a brewing. I see that. <laughs> I'll try.